To write the name for FeI2, we first need to recognize that we have this transition metal, that's the iron, and then iodine here is a nonmetal. So we'll use these rules here to write the name for FeI2. First, we write the name for the metal, as it appears on the periodic table. Fe, that's iron. Next, we're going to write the name for the nonmetal, also as it appears on the periodic table. I, that's iodine, lowercase i. And then we're going to cross out the ending, this I-N-E, and change it to I-D-E. So far, we have iron iodide is the name for FeI2. But Fe, that's a transition metal. And since it's a transition metal, we have to figure out the charge and write that in the name here. We know that iodide, that's in group 17, sometimes called 7A, is 1 minus. We have two of them. That means this adds up to 2 minus. The iron has to be 2 plus. So we're going to write Roman numeral 2 with parentheses right in the middle of the name. That makes the name for FeI2 iron 2 iodide. And this 2 in parentheses is because of this 2 up here on the iron. This is Dr. B with the name for FEI2, Iron 2 Iodide. Thanks for watching.